Hi friends. So it's Friday and on Fridays we usually put out brand new webisodes and in a way that's what we're doing today. But um, this webisode is a little different than all the other ones and a lot of the reason why it's different is because we live in Orlando, Florida. Well, we live about 45 minutes away from Orlando, Florida, but we are very close to Orlando and this has been a very, very rough week as most of you know for those of us who live in Orlando. Actually this has been a really rough week I think for most of us who live in the United States. Um, this week we have had not one but two shootings with fatalities. We also lost a young little two-year-old boy who was on vacation with his family. Normally on our webisodes we include little funny things about our lives what we do, homeschooling, just stuff like that. This week's webisode was supposed to be a concert that we went to and actually I'm still going to show it. We're still going to we're still going to show it. But it's not the webisode that we had in mind. It's not going to be the version that I had in mind when we first um, set out to film the webisode. Uh, back in January we went to a concert called Winter Jam in Tampa, Florida. And there is a band there that we met. Um, the lead singer actually came out to us while we were standing in line. And he sang a song to us. And he prayed for us. And it was a really awesome time. We enjoyed it a lot. In fact, here's a clip. They have a song out on the radio, and they play it on Christian stations, and the band is called We Are Messengers. We ended up buying merchandise from them, and we bought their CD before it even was available to the public. They are a Christian band, and we really enjoy their music and the positive message that they um, send out with their music. I will put a link in the description um, to their music and to their website so that you can check them out if you haven't heard of them already. So fast forward some time and we got word that they were coming back to Florida. And so we got concert tickets and we we're very excited to go. I guess you, I'm riding in this one. So I like don't want to ride with all the. Right. I, I, I think most of the. Ashton, most of the crazy the ladies. ladies. I think all the older teens are riding in that car. Because. Unless you want to ride in this one, Ashton. Mm -hmm. I'll ride with the cool kids. Yeah. That's cool us. Kids over here. But we hold on. We have to make sure we have enough room in both cars. I'm both cars car. should be completely full. full. Not, okay, then we need more people over there. Even it out. Uh, the tickets are in there and the address is on it. No, we're gonna follow you. Wait, are you following me or are we following you? Okay. Okay, so we are on our way to a concert. It's a Christian concert for a band called We Are Messengers. If you haven't heard of them, check them out and um, come along with us. The concert was really fun and we enjoyed the time together and we danced and we sang and we worshiped our hearts out and um, we just spent time with each other and enjoying the concert and um, it was great. It was this little tiny venue out in the middle of a cow pasture at this little awesome church. Uh, right in the middle of the concert, the uh, lead singer Darren was introducing a song called I'm on Fire. And when he had introduced the song, he kind of stopped in the middle and gave this off-the-cuff speech. I wasn't going to include it in the video originally because the audio is terrible. Like, terrible. We filmed it on our GoPro 
and we were thinking we were just going to get some footage of the concert but um, <laughs> he ended up giving this awesome little speech. Even though we filmed this two weeks ago, I wanted to share it because I feel like the words that he said are more relevant today than they were two weeks ago. So I included some subtitles so that you can actually understand what he's saying. Um, Darren has a super great accent from Ireland and it is really fun to listen to him talk anyways, but um, unfortunately the audio is terrible. So um, here's what he had to say. You know how we're going to change our communities by not finishing the Jesus Christ. We can't hide Jesus Christ and expect people to find him. Go and show them. Instead of this morning with Jesus, we are sitting with prostitutes and tax collectors and outcasts and rappers. He was not having Bible study. He was not having small groups. He was being with them because they were his people. Your country is so divided. And maybe you can't even see what I can see. It's time to unify this place. We're going to see a movement of what commands a blessing? Unity commands a blessing. I don't care if you're black, white, pink, or blue. I don't care if you're gay or straight. I don't care if you're poor or rich. I don't care what you are. You are welcome. That is not to be confused with letting the truth go. Everyone's welcome at my table. Everyone is welcome at Christ's table. But Christ never left a single person where they were. Every one of them will radically change. Every one of them. Love them all. We can't hide Jesus and expect people to find him. Those are some powerful words. And if you couldn't read the speech, I'm going to go ahead and put what he said down in the description so that you don't have to <laughs> rewind it, rewatch it in order to hear the speech. After the concert, we got to hang out with the band for a little bit and they signed autographs for us. And it was really fun and we had a really awesome evening. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos, hit the subscribe button. We post new videos every Friday. I like your hat, Emily. Signed and everything. So we are, get in here, going to Mo's. Okay, so we just saw, we, we just saw We're the Messengers and we are at Open Water Church and it's in Tampa. And we've got people taking selfies. We're at Open Water Church in Tampa and uh, super impressed at this little church out here in the middle of the cow pastures. So uh, if you get a second, um, go on to uh, openwaterchurch.com. I'm going to put the link into the description and check out um, check out their stuff that's online. Uh, I heard that Darren from Where the Messengers did a uh, sharing this morning in um, church, and it was really awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and put the link for that also in the description. And if you are not a big fan of We Are The Messengers, you need to you take, should be. You should be because they are super, super fantastic and they did a great job tonight. So um, thank you, We Are The Messengers, for um, for coming here to Florida and for hanging out with us and singing to us and we really appreciate it.